Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are checking out a highly portable solar panel to trickle charge your 12 volt batteries. It is a 20 watt monocrystalline solar cell panel that maintains the charge of a 12 volt battery of a car, boat, an RV, or any other 12 volt battery when it is not in use to prevent natural battery discharge which will also extend the life of that battery. Now it measures in at 16 inches long, 11.4 inches wide, and just 0.67 inches thick. Now it weighs in at just 1.56 pounds. Now it has a built-in intelligent and safe charge controller on the back of the solar panel with LED light indicators. So it is really easy to see the status of the charge, especially if it is mounted on the windshield of a car with the provided suction cups. You can either mount it on the outside of the car or even on the inside of the windshield. Now the blue light indicates in the sun and working status. The red light indicates charging and a green light indicates fully charged status of the battery. It has overcharge protection, short circuit protection, reverse polarity, reverse current, over temperature, and overload protections. It has a maximum power of 20 watts, VMP of 18 volts, IMP of 1.11 amps, open circuit voltage of 21.6 volts, short circuit current of 1.22 amps. It comes with a 7.5 feet long cable with the SAE connector. It also comes with a 22 inch alligator clip cable for direct battery connection, a 22 inch cigarette lighter plug for cars with ignition bypass, and an O-ring to SAE cable, which I have cut in half and soldered on an XT60 male connector for use in my applications comes with four suction cups and two carabiners. Now, one thing I really like is that they provide the waterproof terminal caps to prevent accidents like short circuit, but it doesn't come with it on the main cable of the solar panel where it is needed the most. So I took it off from the O-ring cable where it is not really needed and zip tied it to the main cable. All right, let's go and check out the open circuit voltage. And we have 19.8 volts, open circuit voltage. Okay, here it is on my trailer tongue and it is charging my breakaway battery, as you can see here. And let's check on the bottom. Okay, I got the blue light and the red light. The blue light indicates in the sun, the red light indicates it is charging, but the green light indicating that is fully charged is not lit yet. So it is charging at the moment. Okay, we're back. Let's check and see what's going on. And check it out, green light. That means it is fully charged. Okay guys, so got the suction cups attached to the solar panel and mounted the solar panel on the inside of the car facing out. So it is in the sun and it is working because I don't have it connected here yet. And here we go, we're gonna connect it right now and it is showing 12.1 volts on the car battery. So let's go ahead and plug it in, see what happens. It immediately jumped to 12.2 and let's check it out here. And it is charging. So hopefully pretty soon it'll jump to 12.3, 12.4 and slowly go up from there. So it's a trickle charge about 20 watts at one amp. So it's gonna take a while. So it's not something that you need to remove 
just leave it on there. It will slowly trickle charge the car battery. Okay, I'm back after about an hour and it went up to 12.5 volts. So yeah, it is working. See that? It is still charging. Okay, the solar panel is outside on the ground and coming in, bifurcating and it is charging up my 12 volt sealed lead acid battery and the other bifurcation is going to my 12 volt fan which is working at the moment so that little solar panel is actually charging up this little battery and this little battery is running the fan so not just for trickle charging It's actually working. So if we look at the bottom here, it is in the sun working and it is charging. Pretty good, huh? So as you can see, it has a lot of uses, especially to maintain a trickle charge of your car battery. Now, if you go on trips and have to leave your car at home, or even a parking lot, you can keep your car battery topped off and prevent the natural battery discharge and ensure that your car starts up right away when you get back from your trip and start your car. Now, I've always wanted one of these to maintain the battery on my van, which I use only a handful of times a year. Now, the bigger 50 watt solar panel that I have is a bit too much power and it has to be placed on the ground or mounted somewhere. Now with this one, I can simply stick it inside of the car windshield and keep it safe. So that'll do it for this video of the OIMSA's 20 watt portable solar panel battery trickle charger. The price is $49 by the way, but it now has a 50% off clip coupon. So you end up paying only $25, which is a really nice price. So check it out. The link is down below in the video description. So I thank you so much for tuning in and watching. Have a great day and we'll see you again next time. Look at that. It's actually charging up my 200 watt power station.